Excuse me, Spider-Man, would you mind if I quickly had sex with your ship? So hello everybody, uh, welcome to the Nid Whitelist server and I'm on with somebody, well, a bit new to you if not new to me, this is Nordic Beast, we've not recorded oh, before, oh, 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 oh. oh have we? No we did, I tell you when we recorded. Uh, when did we record? It was my first day on the server. That's true, well I, I had to scrap that recording though because uh, I had a bad codex for DXTari. So I had to scrap that. I, I never did post that recording. But oh, we did shame. technically record together. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> uh, so I did, you were on some of the video, you know, it was, we recorded for what, an hour and a half or something? And I just yep. cut a few highlights out of that to make an episode, uh, which was mostly <laughs> Boris talking, to be honest. <laughs> yeah. Um, and, and Anubis attempting to build, but dicking around half the time. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Some. Yeah, it's sort of business as usual, really. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, that's nothing new around here. Uh -huh. So, um, yeah, so we've, Nordic and I, we've got a little bit of business to conclude today. Um, but before we do, I just want to, I've, I've asked Nordic over to, to mine and Boris's place here uh, to come and see something. And um, this, you probably wouldn't recognize it to look at it. This is my old work in progress ship, which is no longer named work in progress. <laughs> it's called the Adjacency. I, I thought a huge bitch would be a good name, but they got voted down. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's, it's nearly, but not quite complete. I think it's complete at the front. Um, yeah. It looks like there's some gaps in the back, but it's almost done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think there's just... Are you guys going to seal this up? Like, are you going to pressurize the inside, or are you not going to bother with that? I'm not bothered about pressurization, because I re absolutely point-blank refuse to take my helmet off until I don't have a beard. Uh, <laughs> and so if you What's can't... What's wrong with having a beard? <laughs> I, I have quite a large beard, actually. <laughs> a beard is just fine on a man. Uh, and I don't, I don't mind being an androgynous character at all. It's not like I need to be a female, but I will not have a beard. I'm, you know, I just draw the line at being a bearded woman. Um, Understood. But yeah, th I mean, we've got gravity. This is oh. this is the old middle of the ship. This is where um, there's my oxygen tank and the cockpit on it. But all of this. Well, that, the that's why I asked if you were gonna pressurize it and put oxygen in here because the cockpit's already oxygenated yeah yeah so <laughs> don't actually need it but what i do like to make with a drilling ship um even though this isn't a the, the main purpose for this uh this ship is actually to make bases it makes walls and it makes floors it makes flat surfaces uh yeah. it's good at collecting resources but um i don't really need to do that much resource gathering these days but, yeah. Well, no, you'd be surprised how quickly you can go through stuff when you come up with a project. Uh, when, yeah, whenever when, you, I, when you've got a Boris to keep fed. Well, that's true. <laughs> I mean, God, the size of the base here, jeez. <laughs> yeah, we can go in and have a look at that shortly, because um, oh, yeah. I know where we're up to on, on that. Uh, but yeah, the, the inside of this ship, uh, all these walkways and gantries, um, I mean, it, it was just an open, a completely open ship uh, before. Yeah. And this is all Mia. Ooh, you so have a... I have, been, I have a little helper. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, this is a hell of a ship. <laughs> I mean, this is I mean, amazing. there's probably as much, there's probably as many resources in this ship as there is in building my base. <laughs> and I mean, I, I've got a large base, too. It's just, whew, this place is huge. Yeah, there's like upstairs and downstairs. And... I have to admit, he did a great job in mixing these levels, like with the catwalks and everything. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you notice the little chair over there? Like, I, I was walking over there earlier. Kind of have to go around the gravity generator. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. Oh, except for I can't see without my light. Okay, Mira, you need to put lights in here. That's your next step. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Is that like a passenger seat? Yeah, passenger seat. Yeah, <gasps> oh, that's just, that's just too cute. <laughs> <laughs> that's... Oh, I noticed you used heavy armor, too. Uh, I think the floor, the heavy armor floor, was probably there. Might be stuff I already had in, because uh -huh. I built my platform out of heavy armor. Um, ah, okay. So that might be original. Yeah, it is at the original level, actually. Yep. Yeah, because the rest of it's light armor. Yeah, I see it over here. So, I mean, this is just... I am just absolutely... Well, I'm very grateful, Mia. <laughs> um, it's... Ah. Where? <laughs> There's a. I found the antenna, and it's like kind of wedged in the front sideways. Yeah, I have an antenna. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I never used to have an antenna. Yeah, you got an antenna. <laughs> I feel like I just found a secret spot. Yeah. Like it's yeah, just yeah. kind of tucked away up here. Oh yeah. You can play hide and seek in here. And this is amazing, isn't it? Um, Sal, you locked me out of the grinder. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think, because uh, I did see that message, uh, I think I fixed it, but I probably best had check and make sure that uh -huh. I uh, uh, opened the grinders back up. <laughs> Who'd you lock out? Was it Boris? Uh, no, that was me. Oh, <laughs> Poor I Mir think it was me. Out. Oh yeah, I can't lock Boris out of anything because um, <sighs> I ended up um, joining his faction. Oh. It was when you when you're in a house share with somebody, you don't really want to have a door that needs two keys. Understood. If you know what I mean, it's um, yeah. You... How does it? Well, well, how does it feel to be a tickle me pravishite? <laughs> oh God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's um <laughs> There you go, Boris. You can use that. that that's that's oh, the name of your fans. God. Tickle me Porish Borishites. Oh my word. It's um Yeah. <laughs> no, I have. I've set this to share with all now, so have we got everything on share with all? Yes we have. Good. Yeah, yeah. So, I, yeah, it, I'm pretty sure it was me. Uh, uh, are I you at the out. cell? You oh, yeah. oh, okay. So it was the base that you locked him up. <laughs> uh, no, it's or... the grinder up here. Uh, when oh. we were doing a bit of work, and mm -hmm. I'd gone offline to oh, I'd been playing with Anubis. Uh, I'd gone to do a bit of recording with Anubis, and I'd left um, Mia. Uh, and he could access the welder, but he couldn't access the grinder. Oh no. Mm. So yeah, uh, I uh, I owe you a certain something. Uh, so <laughs> that we, is true. We negotiated some quite reasonable terms, I thought. Um, yeah. And I've mentioned this to Boris. It's like that. Quite happy with uh, with how the negotiations have gone. I think we've got a fair deal there. Um, it's it's only a little expensive on the grounds that uh, Boris buys so much stuff. <laughs> so well, I still owe him one more ship. Mm -hmm. but, uh, that, that's in the works right now. Cool. Uh, well, he's also got another three ships that uh, he would like. So yeah, would you would you care to join me inside, and I'll show you uh, what's going on in here. Oh sure thing. Yeah, I just refilled my oxygen bottle, so I should be good for a while. Cool. I love this front door. This is awesome. <laughs> it's been a while since I've been here. Yeah. I, I ran into Boris a while back. Like he was just in, and I felt like a little ninja. I didn't know I was there. <laughs> and he was working on something, and I shut off, I like, shut off my broadcasting, and yeah. I was running around up top watching him. <laughs> and I kept typing to him, and I'm like, Boris, I'm a space ninja. And he just <laughs> was none the wiser, had no idea I was up there. <laughs> oh, for some reason, that, that's not working for me. Oh, there we go. Oh. No, no, go. no it yeah. must have just been a moment of lag. I've probably <laughs> opened and closed it so many times. 
There we go. I'm going in before it squishes me. Yeah, yeah. Though, from my understanding, it just shoots you out because uh, I heard Boris play tested that once. <laughs> Anubis was telling me, he was like, yeah, close the doors on me, and he just shot through. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I. You know what? I can't wait till he's done with this just so mm -hmm. I can do stuff here. Yeah? I, I don't know what, but, you know, just hang out. We'll have a club. Yeah. I actually get Spider-Man on here, like, maybe maybe have Spider-Man build a bar under here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, th this was, I think, before you were really part of the NID. Mm -hmm. Spider-Man once built a, built a bar on the public server, and it was nice. Really? <laughs> yes. That he, uh, he definitely outdid himself on that one. Had a <laughs> VIP room and everything. Wow. Well, obviously, as the as one of the residents of the establishment, I would expect to be invited into the VIP room. <laughs> well, you got to talk to him about that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Industrial control. You know what? I should do that. I, I like the little signs up everywhere. Mm. Like, in my base, because uh, right now my base is share with all, so if anyone ever spawn, you know, yeah. pops up at the med bay, they can go around. But my base is kind of confusing. So I might need to put some signs up soon. <laughs> Let's just see. I think the um, I think the refinery should be switched off at the moment, but um, even if they're not refining anything, they will will suck some power. So yeah. it is usually best to shut them off. Um, I love this corridor between all the refineries. This is fantastic. Yeah. I just wanted to have a quick look and see. Yeah, yeah, it's just refining stuff now. Let's switch it back off again. Yeah, they're, it sounds like they're all running. Mm -hmm. There we go. Um, I just wanted to see if there was still stuff in there. Um, and there is. Which is good. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I did a uranium run earlier with my mm -hmm. uh, with my long ship, the uh, the burrowing drill ship I have, which now has a jump drive on it, which is so useful. Yeah, uh, I was able to jump about 140 kilometers, and I dug up, and this is all in less than five minutes. I dug up about 300,000 uh, kilograms of uranium, and then teleported back and was refining almost immediately. Cool. Yeah, those those jump drives. Whew, I love them. Yeah, I've not tried them uh, yet. Oh, we'll have to take a trip earlier in my, uh, my yeah. hot rod. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, what's in here? Uh, oh, that's is here, that's oh. the power room. It's... What? Uh... <laughs> oh, what is it? You're blocking me out? What do you got? He's got there secrets go. here? <laughs> oh, okay. No, it's just a new door. Has he not shared it? I can share it. Oh, it's got a bunch of unwelded blocks back here. Yeah, yeah, I'll fix them. <laughs> that's that's my job. Um, cause Actually, if, if he needs, I can build a micro welder, like a a one welding or one welder welding ship. Oh, it's fine. It's um, Boris only welds when he has to. Yeah, yeah, I've witnessed it. Uh huh. Uh, I, I was here the day he put down the entire framework for this mm -hmm. place, and he was like, he, he asked me to come over, and I'm like, and he's, don't look directly here because none of it's welded, and your sims or your uh, your frames will drop, <laughs> and they they drop from at the time this is when you know we first started on here yeah. from about fifty fifty five frames per second down to about five. <laughs> That's how bad it was. God. Right now I'm only getting like ten to twelve. Yeah, but there's I mean there's a lot here. Yeah, yeah. I don't, I I don't suffer too bad. Um, I notice I can tell if there's unwelded blocks around, uh, yeah. and uh, I go weld them up. But yeah, it's all part of the. You see, the thing is about um, uh, about all the unwelded blocks is that if um, if I weld all those blocks up, then uh, then I'll be favourite rather than Anubis. So I'm more than happy to to do all the the <laughs> welding. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you see, yeah, it's. Um, I've got to keep an eye on that Anubis. Did you, did you hear, did you see in either mine or Anubis's video when he was talking about me going away? Because recently, I, I don't think I saw that one. No, I was away for uh, for a few days uh, over the weekend, and Anubis was supposed to be away the same weekend. 
and he took we were away doing one of our mining runs and he told me that while I was away uh, he was going to work on seducing Boris and that when I came back I'd have an eviction notice and he'd have moved in. Uh, and, and Boris is supposed to be building me uh, a, a a fancy office out here somewhere and the yeah. uh, and all of the officers of the minions are going to be above me so that if... Um, if meteors are turned on, I'll have my human shield. All of the, all of his other minions <laughs> will protect me with their lives. Um, and Mia's been suggesting that, like, because of the way Anubis is about, mm -hmm. you know, trying to get me evicted and all that sort of thing, that <laughs> yeah. I should really start um, start troubling Boris about this office because Mia reckons it'd be harder to get me evicted if I'm properly established. You see, and I never really thought about that because I'm not a nester. I, I like my ships. I'm quite. I just like having somewhere that I can call my own as a sort of garage, sort of yeah. somewhere where. Because yeah, I've got my my ships back here. Um, let's just have a look at what state they're in. Actually, it's kind of my, the first thing I usually <laughs> do when I come on the server is just come and have a look at the ships and see if everything's fine. And uh, obviously, I need to put the wheels on the school bus. The the drills yeah. do need a tiny little bit of maintenance, but nothing, right. nothing major. Um, uh, did, did you see my video that involved the uh, oh, school bus? The yeah, the uh, <laughs> it's not Detroit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, which actually kind of brings me back around to uh, uh, Drunk Spider-Man. Actually, yeah. The, the first knit event I was part of was our uh, oh, what was the name of that game? Uh, zero, zero something. Uh, it was our race event. God, F Zero, yeah. the F Zero yeah. races, and it was between races. We're sitting there, and Drunk Spider Man's parked next to me, and all of a sudden I hear a grinder, and I look over, and he's grinding off one of my thrusters. And I was like, "Hey, what are you doing?" He's like, "You're from Detroit. You should be used to it." Did he's grinding down my thruster? <laughs> oh, it's dear. not that bad. Well, uh, no, it is pretty bad. But <laughs> I don't have to deal with that. Uh huh. <laughs> Absolutely. Right. Well, um, I think we've got a few minutes left on, on the episode. So shall we uh, just go indoors and uh, I shall... Because, yeah, I think it's about time we sorted out a little transaction. I'm fine now, with that. Mm, as, as we have discussed offline, um, the, the terms are commercial and in confidence. Uh, commercially, commercially negotiated terms in private yeah, yeah, confidence. Yeah. So, uh, uh, so we'll just cut away while uh, uh, whilst we sort this out. Well, you do know if you don't pay me, I will break Boris's kneecaps, right? <laughs> I will fill his med bay with his bodies. <laughs> uh, I'm in the component container. That's why I can't see any ingots. Uh. Yeah, horses. <laughs> you to... Wait, are these all? conveyed up yeah oh, oh yeah come and have a um actually i'm not sure how we get through now the conveyors are all under the floor uh <laughs> nice. i, I thought hatch. they were just randomly placed <laughs> no they're uh and the green ones are um uh are for ingots the blue ones are for components uh, and yeah, yeah. The so the tubes and the all of the machinery all sort of tie up. So you can see sort of back here the the colour schemes of the the pipes. So where wow. you've got blue pipes, that's uh, that's components, and where you've got green, that's ingots. Very nice. But the was... I, I like Boris's met, uh, methods here. Like I thought mm. it was just chaos, but nope, nope. No, no, no. There's there's stuff going on there. All right. Um, it's there's it's still not quite right though. Uh, we might be able to get under the floor down here. Can we still? We used to be able to. Ah, uh, you can kind of drill. just get your your head underneath. Yeah. Oh yeah, look at that. Yeah, there used to be an access point under there. Um, but I think uh, Boris has sealed it so that because uh, he wants the ba the base pressurized. Ooh, that is going to take a lot of oxygen. I tried to pressure... <laughs> well, 
my entire base can be oxygenated. Mm -hmm. uh, one time I tried to do it, and it sucked up so much ice that I ran out of ice, wow. like, immediately. <laughs> wow. And uh, my whole base was only at low. So I had to uh, depressurize and then pressurize a small area. And then I had to go get some ice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah. This would take a lot. I think my, my big drilling ship will come in handy for that kind of thing, I think. 